You can use any combination of carabiners for these bungee tool leashes. This is its resting length, and this is how far I can stretch. We're gonna test the Shinda bungee leash now. It broke at the sewn end. 4.29 kilonewtons. This is Al Nasser's orange bungee tool leash. It also broke at the sewn termination. Peak was 4.26 kilonewtons. These leashes pair best with the smaller carabiners that these manufacturers make. The leash end holes are a little smaller, so they pair better with more narrow carabiners. You'll be able to manage to get these smaller carabiners into them as well. Uh, it just might be a little bit snug, but they can fit with little finagling. However, your standard carabiner size, which has a larger spine, just is a bit too snug. So yeah, these are a nice option if you're looking for something more budget-friendly and lightweight to hold your tools. They also have a carabiner that's one size up. Let me know if you're interested in those.